Yo, guys, and welcome to Gusto Reaction on Gusto TV. Donifeski out here, and then it is the Eddie's season. You know, Eddie's back to back. Uh, um, the, the, the award is coming soon. Nomination is out. Flying all the way to the US. Lala, how many artists would they fly to the US? All the artists are responsible for going to the US by themselves. When is the awards night? Codet, codet. This is an opportunity for some of these artists who have not been to the US before mm. to collect US visa and mm. go to the US. So, so, so the consulate will give them visa because they are going to collect awards. No, the consulate. I mean, the headies would be an invitation for okay. them to come and attend. I mean, that means they have some sort of experience in the US, mm. and because it's headies and the consulate and headies are in partnership, it will be mm. easier for these guys to get visa for this particular visa. It's much more mm. easier for them to say, oh, I'm going to go on holiday or mm. some other things. At least they have the, they have an engagement, what they yeah. have to go and attend yeah. to. Yeah. So it's, it's codedly, it's good news for yeah. not just the artists, some of the people around them. Mm -hmm. I know that um, whether you whether you like people who are close to them will be like they'll be eyeing it that ah, Baba, will they go ahead this way? I will follow you. Yeah. you yeah. Will yeah. Come yeah. Name, you know, <laughs> they have home. so it's you know it's a good thing for some of them. Mm. Um, you don't have to fly, it's not the obligation of Hades to fly anybody down. Okay. Uh, the artist to make their way down if they want to attend the event. Mm. Oh, so it is uh, based on the artist if you uh, want to attend the event and you have the funds, uh, you are free to you know get that one. So is it now, now I want to get more clarification on that one. Is it if you are being nominated, you can go or if you are winning an award for the night? No, if if no, <laughs> if you are nominated, you can go now. You have you're nominated oh. for the award. If you want to attend okay. the award okay. ceremony. Okay. No, it's not if you win, you know. I don't think only well, maybe it's a few people you know that they're actually going to win and they'll make sure that they're there. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Last night is somebody knew he was going to win something. And mm -hmm. he got he went there on the private with a private jet, and yeah, the results. Yeah. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Anyways, uh, I love artists that back there. I um, love nominations, and one of the artists that has multiple nominations is Olamide himself, Bado, the emperor of the street, like she would always call him. Uh, Bado has had uh, a very, very smooth um 2020. Can we say that looking at 2020 with Olamide's um 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 catalog of songs that he's dropped, is featured on. I would say he's had uh, one of the best um, years out of all of the artists in 2022. Are you saying from 2020? 2022, rather, 2022, just the space of 20, 20, five months. Yeah. Yeah, he actually started the year on the high. He started really well. Um, well, that comes from, from nothing. From Zazu in December. Yeah, from Zazu in December to about mid February, he mm. was having a, a great one. Now he's. I don't know. I mean, so he's supposed to even that one was supposed to even inspire him, but it looks like Omar is saying, Omar, I have to slow down. I don't want to, mm. this is going to be my last album and things mm. like that. Mm. But yeah, he had a really good one as a feature as a feature as a trend trying to. But yeah, he has no bearing on this award though. Yeah. Mm. Uh, anyways, he's got five nominations. He's part of the best male artist. You know, he got one six. for best um, six nominations actually. Best male artist alongside them, Top Boys, Whiskey, Olamide, Davido. And then it's got um best rap album for Cafe DM. It's got best rap single for um loading and a couple of more um categories. Uh, it's also got one on shoot up with um portable, you know, for Zazu. Uh, looking at how big Golamde is, um, some guys you know, on his level are getting about seven, nine on nominations. Uh, looking at Olamde now having six, can we say that um six is enough or too small for Badu? To be honest. Some of those six are not even deserved. If we're going to keep it a book, we're going to keep mm. it a view. Mm. I think some of the songs were placed in categories they don't belong to. Mm. And I think they, perhaps they were just trying to appease him. We know Olamide is very much. Olamide doesn't care about rapping these days. He just makes music yeah. that people yeah. like, right? And he does his thing. We mm. know. We, um, but here we are. We have Olamide in the best rap single and his. Song that is being nominated for no best rap song, yes. Then there's also the is it the best rap album? Rap Cafe album, yeah, Cafe DM. Cafe DM that is filled with loads of song of Olamide singing and having. Yeah. Like we said Olamide changed his style mm -hmm. with mm -hmm. Cafe DM, and here we are. 
He supposed Olamide, who has changed his style, is being nominated for the best rap award. So I think his 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 his, his nominations were misplaced. If I would put it that way, mm. they were, these songs, these albums were put in wrong categories. Mm. Is it because they thought, oh, there's no way he could have gone, um, he could have gone head toe to toe with these other records in other categories? I don't know what the head mm. is were thinking. Mm. But yeah, I think the fact that he got six, he should just be happy that yes, he got six. Mm-hmm. He shouldn't, he shouldn't uh, so, six. so according to you, you feel that these um, six nominations are not deserving at all for Olamide? Well, I would say that Olamide deserves to be nominated in several categories, right? Yeah. But, but, but he's, he's been put in, in the wrong category, which undermines, I mean, how huge or how important those his change of style or his mm. album, how good the album was, how good some of the songs were. Yeah. yeah, loading is more of a street pop record yeah. than a rap record. Like, yeah. why is loading not being uh, nominated in that category? Why is it being put? It's being shoved into the rap just because Olamide used to be a rapper. Yeah. He himself changed his style. Yeah, he said yeah. he made he made music, different yeah. kind of music, yeah. and looks like the Eddies have decided not to acknowledge that fact. Yeah. Anyway, looking at Eddie's and Olamide's um, relationship in the past, and you mentioned something about you know Eddie's trying to appease Olamide. Uh, all of these nominations that you say are like maybe a bit misplaced. Is it because Eddie's do not want any while like, again from Olamide in um, 2022? That's why I say, Omo, we just keep by doing it, some categories, some awards. So look at all these categories now. Mm. If Olamide, critically looking at it, Olamide may perhaps not even win one category based mm. on what these categories you, they've put him in. He may not because in a rap record, there are better rap songs, there are hotter rap songs in that. Uh, in that category, they are more mm-hmm. likely to win. Like mm-hmm. right? in the street pop category, there's a certain Bella Schmoda, there's a certain KPK with uh, Mobad and, mm-hmm. and these uh, this guys in there. He may not actually win anything at the end of the day. So, mm-hmm. in, in, uh, maybe if what you're saying is true, in an attempt to in an attempt to appease him, which I don't think it is, that means mm-hmm. that setting, setting him up for more drugs, six nominations, mm-hmm. he can end up with zero. Hmm. And setting Lambda up for more drugs again, another another angle. We just hope that you know uh, this this doesn't happen to Lambda Bado. Uh, a lot of artists have been acknowledging here and there, you know, reposting and all of that. Uh, do you expect Lambda to also you know acknowledge some of these nominations from the edits? No, I think it's part it's past that level. Um, last year was the year for him, and um, the last edition was the year for the him and uh, Fireboy. Yeah, and they swept they swept majority of the awards. Mm. Uh, in there. So yeah, um, I don't think if he doesn't acknowledge, I don't think it's a is an issue. But yeah, mm-hmm. he's got nominated. Um, he's, he's not the person to get freaked out for these things. I don't see a Bonner uh, acknowledging. I don't see a Wiz <laughs> acknowledging. Right, so, right. David himself, I don't see because even David said, <laughs> mm-hmm. I don't see him ever acknowledging. <laughs> no, 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 <laughs> David <laughs> don't want that day. <laughs> Let the ones who never collect this thing before we make it the way they shock. Let them be. Mm. Mm. Yeah, not for all right guys. all right guys thank you so much big lala uh guys you've heard it all uh all i'm this six category lala feels that you know some of these categories are actually misplaced uh some of them are like ah well i'm this be here let us know what you think does bado deserve these six categories that he was nominated he has been nominated for at the forthcoming and he's share your thought down below in the comment section we'll catch you on the next gospel reaction till then stay safe bye guys